I always say it's the next step. I break it into the preseason, then the conference season, then ACC tournament, and the NCAA tournament. So I always look at it the, the same way. We've got an opportunity to go play, and we've done pretty doggone well for three months, and now we get a chance to uh, try to do it again over a four or five day period. Uh, we've played pretty well. We just haven't, uh, I think we've, help me on this, I think we've been in the finals three of the last four years. Three of the last four years, we just haven't gotten over the hump. Uh, I'd like to, if we're going to be there that long, let's win the whole daggum thing. Yeah, there's no question about that. But uh, I'll know more about it after they come to practice today. But I think they'll still be enthused after uh, what was a good win for us on Saturday night. Uh, I think they'll be rested because of not having anything to do yesterday. And it was a fairly pretty day. So I expect us to have a, a good practice and be in a good frame of mind. You know, I had a silly th thought about maybe coming back here and cutting them back here, but I decided not to do it. I mean, you know, it's it's more fun when there's people around. You know, there's no question. But uh, uh, when we got on the bus, Brad showed me a picture of what Franklin Street looked like, so we told the bus driver, let's go to Franklin Street. We got there, and they'd already run everybody out. <laughs> you know, so uh, they still had it blocked off, so we'd pull up there, Brad asked if we'd go through, because there were, you know, 13 people still there. And uh, so we went down Franklin Street, and it's amazing the people that came out of that, hadn't gone home and had just gone back into the restaurants or the establishments and uh, and so that was that was that was neat but it was just doing something silly you know, kind of thing. No Playing 18 games is more important than three or four or five depending on which team you are uh, uh, at the end of the season in the ACC tournament. Um, I take a lot of pride in trying to play well the entire year. Uh, we've been pretty successful. Uh, Steve said the other night it was our seventh in uh, uh, 13 years and that's pretty doggone impressive. And uh, well, there's no question that we've gotten better defensively. You still have to get so much better being uh, consistent with our box outs. I mean, uh, our big guys, sometimes they box out and sometimes they don't. Bryce is one of the two best rebounders I've ever coached. And he's not very good at boxing out. He just goes and gets the ball. But sometimes that go guy goes running right by him. First play of the Virginia game, his guys want it tapped it in. And, you know, so those kind of things. But uh, we want to be more consistent defensively on the ball. There's no question we've got to uh, keep the dribble in front of us and be more consistent finishing the defense. Because you look at some of our losses this year, we were horrible with second chance points for the other team. Uh, in Texas, I think it was like 27. So I think that would be something that consistency of boxing out would uh, finish the defense a lot better. We're looking back at last year as, you know, we got to finish it out. And that's, you know, been a big thing for us is just finishing games. And uh, so this year, you know, we're going to go with it, uh, go in with the same mindset that we did last year of going in there and uh, competing. And um, just this time, we got to finish it out and uh, accomplish that goal that we want. That goes back to the AAU days, honestly, um, except it's a whole nother level. Uh, last year, having to go all those games back to back, um, it definitely. By the end of the by the end of the tournament, you're definitely your legs are pretty gone. Um, so to have, I guess, the double buy that we have, um, you know, it does nothing but helps our legs. Now we still have to be more focused going into it because we're going to be playing against a team that already played a game or two. Um, so they're into the tournament a lot more than we would be. Um, but I mean, the double buy does nothing but helps us. I think the biggest thing um, is just making the easy play. You know, sometimes I know for me, um, I get caught up in trying to make that play that I think will, you know, maybe it'll get us a basket. But at the end of the day, there's more um, more opportunities to get points than trying to force things in there. Um, and I think we've done a lot better job. I think Joel hit it on there of just valuing the ball a lot more um, and realizing that, you know, we don't always have to score um, off an amazing play or anything like that. I mean, we just have you know, so many guys that can score that we can make the easy play a lot more.